outside a few times over the last week to vlog and haven't really vlogged. So, we're going to see what happens today. It is Sunday the, is it the 5th? First Sunday in August, child. I, I think it's the 5th. Um, and I am out trying to source a few things. Um, one, I am trying to find some wheatgrass. Um, I found some at a local health food, well, not just food, but a local health store. Um, and I'm, I should have called ahead to see if they have some. But since I'm going over to this area anyways, I figure I'll just hop in and see. Because y'all, I found this um, recipe for wheatgrass shots um, that popped up on my TikTok feed. And I tried, I don't think I've tried fresh wheatgrass, but I've tried like wheatgrass powder and wheatgrass has that distinctive scent that you can also taste that scent and it's not good okay it's very strong but that recipe she used green grapes kiwi wheatgrass and cucumber and i did that yesterday i tried it out yesterday and i also added in some green apple um and it was delicious and it's not really wheatgrass shots for me. Uh, it turns more of a juice, which I have some of it here. Bomb. So delicious. I can't taste the wheatgrass at all. I don't know if that means I use too much of the other fruits. But either way, it tastes delicious. And um, now I'm out trying to see if I can find more wheatgrass. More so because that seems to be the hardest thing for me to source. Um, cause I don't need to buy the other ingredients just yet. I could probably wait a day or two because I still have juice left, but I, I definitely want to get my hands on the wheatgrass cause I know I can leave that sitting in the refrigerator for a couple of days before I get to it. So yeah, it was so good. And, um, I didn't use all of the fruit just with the wheatgrass. I had some green grapes and green apples left. So I made a little juice with that. Also very delicious, very refreshing. Um, I don't think this means necessarily I'm getting back into juicing. Um, but we'll see. Um, hopefully I do make, you know, juice a little more often so that my juicer is not just sitting around collecting dust. Um, yeah. And I also saw this <laughs> on the flip side because you know balance. I saw this s'mores snack on Black Girls and Trader Joe's page. And I'm pretty sure I'm not going to find it. But I'm going to go looking anyways. And I went to... Tr I'm trying to think. Did, I feel like I went out yesterday. No, I didn't, I didn't do anything yesterday. I didn't even record content. I've been saying we're going to record videos. I haven't done anything. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm gonna get back to me not doing anything, but I think it was maybe Friday I went out when I got all the produce and stuff, and I went to Trader Joe's then, really because I wanted some of those, um, hot and spicy chicken wings, and there weren't any, and it was, it was still kind of early for them to be restocking, I think it was, well, they were starting to restock but usually they have a lot of the stuff restocked around the time the store is closing and I, I didn't get there late I got there probably like 7 ish so they were just starting with the restock so I don't know if they have any chicken wings or not but I'm going to see if I can find some of that um cause that's such an easy reach for me where I don't have to do any extra effort other than plop them in the air fryer and eat them um, and I don't, not think about it, I don't have any food, again, well, I don't have any, like, I 
beautiful. <laughs> so, I need to pick up a few things. I feel like I'm babbling. Oh, but yeah, they are. I have not been productive and I don't really know what's going on with me. Like, I don't think I have the seasonal blues. Like, I don't feel like sad or anything. I just, I just haven't felt like doing anything. So I don't know if that counts as seasonal blues. I don't know, but I just, outside of working, I just haven't felt like doing anything at all whatsoever. Um, and I'm trying to get out of it, trying to do something productive and um i think i was trying to vlog about this last week um but that was probably all over the place so i might scrap that footage but um there's been some organization changes at my job so basically there's a new sheriff in town and life as we know it for having the option to work remotely is done and they were like um if you live in a um commutable driving distance you're gonna be hybrid and that's that and i don't like it and i know it's real first world problems and you know but there's this department it's like me being remote doesn't impact my performance at all so feeling like after proving we can successfully be remote even when we at there was a point we didn't have a choice but to be remote now to not offer that option yeah it's hybrid it's only a couple of days a week but i just i feel like it, there should still be an option we should still be allotted the option to if you want to come in or not or if you want to be fully remote and i was going through the motions last week i was ready to flip stuff over i'm like i'm quitting and i was like well okay well where are you gonna go what you gonna do um you still have responsibilities at the end of the day so mm, kind of can't just quit but I think maybe it won't be i'm trying to be positive about it maybe it won't be so bad going hybrid i mean because there, there was a time where we were in there five days a week you know and that was just that but i just i don't know i think maybe if i if go to being hybrid it'll give me a routine outside of the house pushing me to do something i don't know but I just know right now I really don't want to be hybrid but at the same time it kind of is what it is now so yeah um anyways I'm gonna stop babbling um the Trader Joe's parking lot looks hectic <laughs> as I'm riding by it so I gotta turn around and I don't think I'm gonna find what I'm looking for. I don't need the snack anyway, but if I can get my hands on it, I'm gonna be very appreciative. So I'm gonna check back in with you guys shortly to continue babbling, talking about nothing, child. Okay. 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 I'm back again. Um, what's today? Tuesday the <laughs> the eighth. I think today's the eighth. Um, I had to get some gas. Child, gas is back up to almost five dollars again. Here is quite depressing. Um, I tell my sister wants to go to happy hour later, so I'm like, okay, well, I gotta get some gas. And then she's like, well, can you give me... I already know. Here we go with the, with the foolishness. 
can you get me a quick pick while you're there for the Mega Millions? And then on top of that, she, I um put her onto that Trader Joe snack I had got the other day. Um, but it didn't come out the same way it did when I first made it. So now she want me to go to Trader Joe's to see if I can source another one for her. I'm just like, why I gotta be the one to go? You know? I'm just trying to make sure I don't get hit. <laughs> um, so now I gotta be the one getting trampled in Trader Joe's to see if I can find her the s'more snack. Um, the store I stopped at for wheatgrass, they didn't have any the other day, but they took my um name and number down and they called me this morning because they have some wheatgrass. So I'm going to go there first, get my stuff, then I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's to see if they have it. Cause y'all know how Trader Joe's is. You go there one day and they got everything, and then you go the next day and then when so I'm annoyed because she is able-bodied and she could be going to do that for herself. So, and the parking lot looked packed. I am just, y'all know how it be after five when you outside everybody, they get off work, so everybody outside doing stuff. <sighs> so, yeah, we might get a happy hour vlog. We'll see. Cause now I'm annoyed. It got me doing all this running around. Like she really thinks I'm the help. Like she's older and she's always bossing me around. And she was telling me a story cause she went out of town recently and one of the people she was with was bossing her around and she ain't like it. And the way she was describing the story, I'm like, ma'am, that's how you treat me. It's like, oh, I do? I didn't notice. I swear. Oh, my phone on cricket. <laughs> yeah, I'm struggling. And my phone's still cricket. Ugh. Well, I'm about to get my um. I'm gonna check back in with y'all after Trader Joe's because I just saw the parking lot and I already feel stressed out about having to find a spot and then go in and blah blah blah. I really do hate that I sweat from the scalp. Okay, Trader Joe's, a madhouse, no s'mores bars. Um, so I'm really annoyed because I didn't want to go there in the first place. But anyways, I got my wheatgrass. <laughs> so I got my wheatgrass. I'm gonna make some more juice slash shots. I'm annoyed because they could have gave me a bag. He could have gave me a bag for that. Um. So now I gotta hurry up and get home and wipe this foot off my forehead and think about going to this happy hour before I, because I feel like I'm about to change my mind because. She, she got me running all around town like I'm the help. So, um, I'm not gonna roast her on camera if we do go to happy hour, but I'm definitely share a few words with my sister uh, when I see her. So I'm gonna just check back with y'all later because I just, it's, it's the heat, I'm hangry. Um, so yeah, so uh, until the next time. So we're at happy hour. After she had me riding around town searching for things for her, um, I had a little chat with her because I keep telling her I'm not the help. Anyways, um, we got froze. Um, and we ordered some fries. And it's windy and it's cold, so and the music. So, um, I got a little tequila added on top of mine. She did. I'm just gonna drink my drink because I'm stressed out. She's stressing me out.
Okay, y'all, two things. One, um, I just gotta compliment the post office. This lady who was walking entirely too close behind me was like, why is she walking so close? But then she got closer, she's like, mm, you smell good. And I was like, mm, thank you. And then um, I went back to Trader Joe's to press my luck. They had five boxes of the s'mores thing. So I picked up one for my sister. Then I was like, I need more too, you know? Um, Cause I used my second box trying to share with her and she didn't even appreciate it. Cause it, it didn't, the difference between me making them the second time around is the first time they had kind of thawed all the way. Not, I didn't let them thaw the way on purpose, but they had thawed all the way just cause I was ripping and running that day. So they weren't as good the second time around because they they weren't as soft. Um, I probably could have let them thaw or cook them a little longer. But y'all, yeah. um, so I picked up all the boxes, all five of them. I became that person today. And this lady who was like kind of behind me, she was she was actually closer to the cooler, but she was taking too long looking, trying to see what they had. I already knew what I was looking for and where to look. So I kind of swooped in front of her. I started picking up one, then I just picked up all the rest of them. And I'm walking away, and she all, mm -hmm. <laughs> mind your business, okay? My, my own car. Don't be worried about what I got going on over here. Because now she's going to be all nosy, and she looked like she was going to be, well, I don't want to say that because that sounds judgmental, but it, she gave me the vibe that she'll be one of those people that will go and complain to the staff about someone taking X amount of items, you know, when there's plenty of people that shop there. Listen, you snooze, you lose, and mind your business. Um, I still have to say nothing. <laughs> I was just so excited because I got what I went there for, and I'm so happy because I was really depressed the other day because you see, I'm already uh, sweating, so yeah and now i can hopefully um show my sister how they supposed to taste so that she can leave me alone about it <laughs> so anyways i'll check back in later hopefully i can get a free meal matter of fact i'm about to call her to see if i can set the stage to get a free meal and then we're gonna see what happens Hey y'all, uh, welcome back. I'm vlogging again, child. It's really early change of scenery because um, my dad's traveling. So um, I'm holding on to his car while he's away. So he came, got me and I went and dropped him and his girlfriend off to their, their right. They're getting on the bus. Um, Some traveling group they found, so. I love that for them. Y'all, they had on matching outfits. I was so, I don't know if I was annoyed or like, oh, I was just like, y'all just gonna have on matching outfits. And I'm pretty sure she bought that outfit to match his because he's he's had that outfit already. I, but that ain't in my business, child. I need to stay in child's place. <laughs> Anyways, I um just came out of Target. It's Still pretty early in the morning so I was able to get a little bit of footage of what I was doing y'all it's going into that time of the month I just I feel I feel mother nature okay I feel her she's letting me know she's on the way um so I went and picked up a few things for that and um I might either go to Wegmans to pick up some food because I have like nothing either that or there's actually a meal prep place not too far from where i'm at um i'm gonna go see if they're open and if they are i'm gonna see if they have any oh chat a lady walking in front of the car just tripped and since i got my camera out they probably think i'm filming them but i'm filming me i'm gonna just i'm gonna just pull off and and go somewhere else before they walk over here and accuse me of recording them so i'm gonna check back with y'all so
Okay, y'all, it's later in the day, and guess what? Um, that car mount that I got from Timu that doesn't fit in my car on my dashboard, it fits in my dad's truck. So, um, I wish I would have recognized that because I done went back home and left out again. So I could have, um, snatched that up real quick out of my car and put that in here so I don't have to hold it because I'm not going to be able to talk and drive. Anyways, um, I really get on my own nerves. I went, I don't even know if you can hear me because I got the AC up. I went to Target this morning. I got a little footage, probably because it was nice and early and they were stocking. No one was really in there. Um, I went into TJ Maxx. I got a hint of a footage as well. Um, and some, there's some Sephora products. Well, I won't call them Sephora products, but products that I've mainly only seen in Sephora that are appearing in TJ Maxx now, like that Gwen Stefani oil that I planned out before. There's some milk cosmetics, um, milk makeup products showing up. Um, and I just saw some one size products in there and I'm like, okay. Um, I saw them when I was walking in the checkout line and it was the makeup dissolving mist and some wipes. There was some, some eye patches or something I saw, but I had, um, did an about face to go back to the makeup aisle to see if they had setting spray in there and I missed it. They ain't have none. But I was looking now, now if like more one size stuff is popping up there, I need to, um, keep my eyes peeled. And that um estee lauder double wear foundation that i love is i also saw some at tj maxx so it was like 20 bucks and it retails for almost 50. anyways um i just left out of ulta now i've never had a bad experience at this particular store but today i don't i don't know the one associate kind of run me the wrong way um I had asked one of the associates because now I'm trying to find that snail essence stuff. And I don't want to, I don't want the full size. I just want the mini. Um, I could just order it online, but I don't want to have to order X amount. I feel like at this point, I'm probably spending X amount. But, um, and aside from that, I picked this up. This is the Urban Skin RX um, cleansing bar. But I think I was supposed to have picked up the even tone one, which is kind of more of a teal blue color. Um, I thought about just trying this one out anyway, since I picked it up and I do have oily combination. Well, mostly oily. What kind of combination? I don't know, y'all. I could use that, but I think I want to try the other one instead. And the app said everything I was looking for was at this Ulta, including that the new um, Tree Hut stuff. I didn't see any of the new tree. Well, I saw the ocean scent. Um, I smelled the butter and the um, scrub. They're okay. Um, and they're still in the store. <laughs> I had asked one lady um, to go back to the back to look for the Urban Skin Art stuff that was supposed to be in stock there. And turns out it wasn't. And then um, when she came back, I had asked her for something else. And I guess she was walking around the store looking for me because I was walking around still looking. But I don't know. The The other lady walked up to me. She had a bit of an attitude. So I was just like, all right, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just head out. So um, I called a different store, but it's like, it's a drive away, but I'm outside, I guess. I got my water. So I'm going on a little trek. And y'all, I spent entirely too much money in TJ Maxx. That's why I'm really, that's what I meant to say why I'm, uh, why I annoy myself. I'm traveling in two weeks and I shouldn't be spending $150 in TJ Maxx. I just shouldn't be. Anyways, I'm babbling and I'm just going to go over to the um, other Ulta store that I just called. And yeah, because, um, I just am, and I don't really have nothing else to say. So I'm gonna check back with you guys soon.
nice little a peach. What is a peach vodka? I don't know. I'm gonna put um audio over this. So oh, okay, okay. We'll continue chatting, little chatty. I can't help it, child. So I'm out eating with my sister who was late and naked. We need to have a chat about why you're naked. Do you have anything to say? I wasn't late. Do you have anything to say about being naked? I'm not naked. That camera is on you, right? Yes. Okay. I'm not it, it, See what I'm saying? She make it. Like, I can get flagged if I put her on camera. Don't do me like that. <laughs> like, <laughs> maybe I should put her outside. And in this moment, I went too far. almost lost my life at the table, child. You want I'm to going die. too far. Okay. I'm, I'm going to go before. Um, or you lose an arm? I'm gonna go. <laughs> oh, sorry, you can eat your food. My bad. Oh. I'm waiting for you to finish the video so I can eat some of that. I should have ordered my broccoli. 